My main worry is that at this point, John's house must be mostly countdown teapots. <laughs> Do you actually use them to make tea with, or are they just a trophy, just a display item, just something you're very proud of? For the record, I only kept two. I kept one for me and one for my mum, and the rest I drank champagne out of, and then I threw off the top of a multi-storey car park. <laughs> Stand-up comedian, writer, radio host, is there anything John can't do? Yes, he can't leave the house without checking the gases off 15 times. <laughs> John's girlfriend's been with him for nearly a year, and if John's girlfriend is watching, there'll be a helpline number up on the screen at the end of the show. <laughs> what a shame, Jimmy, you delivered those perfectly, but it's been over a year and I have an electric hob. <laughs> <laughs> so the joke's very much on you. Mascot tonight. It's sort of a mascot and it's sort of a, a nemesis. This is uh, Callum Todd. Uh, he is the countdown champion, series 69, which is the one everyone wanted. <laughs> uh, he's quite a controversial series champion because he won the series, but he's not an Octo champ, so <laughs> what's the point? <laughs> <laughs> what, what's an Octo champ? <laughs> Uh, someone who's won eight times, but he only won seven times. Uh, there he is celebrating the cup that he uh, smuggled, as far as I'm concerned. Um, he's there just to fire me up, because I've been, I've been getting a bit lax recently, and I've realised it's time to smash some countdown records. So I'm going for it today, I'm having it. Unlucky, guys. <laughs> yeah, this way, the first record I'm going for, maximum number of nines in one show, four. And we only do four letters rounds, so strap on in. <laughs> in. Strap on or in, OK. <laughs> John, you're eight. Well, it's the word that you use when you're getting dressed. Uh, you put your underpants on and then, of course, it's sock time. <laughs> Joe and Josh are friends in real life. Normally, when you have two good friends, there's a funny one and a good-looking one. What's happened here? <laughs> That's unfair, because everyone else just got jokes about themselves, even when John's... It's about me. <laughs> you just... You're sort of a victim. <laughs> <laughs> Shouldn't be sat next to the alpha, should you, mate? <laughs> I'm going to build the Leaning Tower of Pisa. But I always considered the Leaning Tower of Pisa to be a success because it's a failure. So what I've done is I've not done the bottom layer, so it'll just go nice and straight. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not only going to build the Tower of Pisa, I'm going to correct it as well. And then I'm going to send a picture of it to Italy and see if they can buck their ideas off. There is a nine there. Potassium. <gasps> oh, I know. Obviously, I saw potassium, but it's a comedy show. I went for piss mat. <laughs> <laughs> we can all get nines if we want them, Jimmy. <laughs> <laughs> Times 25. Times 25, oh, 825. Oh, you are fucking kidding me. <laughs> well, what I did there, Jimmy, instead of doing 8 minus 5 is 3 and adding that on, I just plopped the 5 on and got back to me fucking model, didn't I? <laughs> Add 5. Add 5, yeah. Yeah. Two away. That'll do, won't it? It's only a yep. game. It doesn't matter if you got it exactly right, you prick. <laughs> you model-building virgin prick. <laughs> it's the way that when you're having sex and you need some uh, assistance, you apply a certain thing to ease the passage, and the thing that you apply that with is called a lubilator. <laughs> tweeted about Luba later, cos I'm convinced it's a word, so I'll put it out there. So I've just tweeted, hey guys, lost my Luba later. <laughs> Cookied. <laughs> a cookie de cake. <laughs> oh, no, I-E-D, as in to have eaten a cookie. I'm not a, I'm not a fucking idiot. <laughs> <laughs> I'm slightly distracted. OK, how are you distracted? Was it like... The Luba later is now trending on Twitter. <laughs> Largely, it has to be said, down to the work of Nigel Mansell, who's gone mad for it. <laughs> Unbelievable. At Nigeroni Cheese, that's his Twitter handle. He's just put <laughs> LMAO Lubilator, let's get it trending, hashtag legend. <laughs> I will be giving my answers tonight in food-related ways, Jimmy. I like the fact you're basically in a match against Sean here and you're going, I'm going to do this with one hand tied behind my back and still win. I mean, you've picked one of the few uh, disabilities there that wouldn't make any difference to your countdown. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not being cocky, Jimmy, but I think I probably could do this with one hand tied behind my back. Cos I've mastered the skill of not writing with two hands. <laughs> <laughs> Will I am.
Sam has officially bought the rights to Luba later as his next single. <laughs> <laughs> On the proviso that he can spell later L and then number 8 R, so I've turned him down. Uh, you don't fuck around with my tunes. <laughs> John, you often win on Countdown. Uh, how does that feel to finally be a winner in life? <laughs> <laughs> it's like something from Scooby-Doo. You want me to say something to him? Just have a look at him for a minute. OK. <laughs> you are fucking kidding me, right? <laughs> Cheers, mate. That's yeah. OK. <laughs> Channel 4 have asked me to help bring a younger generation back into the show, which obviously what young people like is innuendo. Uh, so they've given me... Uh, this is my mascot for today. Uh, that's two large baps. <laughs> <laughs> and they've given me this, which is uh, my innuendo horn. And if at any point people say something that's an innuendo, I have to uh, give them the horn. <laughs> <laughs> During the evening, you could give me the horn. <laughs> I'm going to put some uh, some stuff on this sausage. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. I love animals, so I'd be doing something with animals, probably cats or dogs. I mean, oh. there's a place um, in South End. There's a place. Um... <laughs> There's a place in South End, a cat hotel that my cats have gone to called the Pussy Palace. <laughs> <laughs> John is really good with numbers, as opposed to women, conversation and emotions. <laughs> it's always like, we always do jokes about everyone, and we, the, the audience laugh. And when you do my ones, everybody laughs. <laughs> I would you go before I'd even finish that one. <laughs> John should try his hand on the X Factor. He can't sing or dance, but if you're looking for tragic backstory, he's world class. <laughs> I can sing and dance, actually. I just keep that very well hidden. <laughs> Let's have some song and dance. Come on, break it out. Uh... <laughs> and I think that'll do. <laughs> it's important to always leave them wanting less. <laughs> John has a habit of meticulously organising the coins in his trouser pocket according to size, is what he told the arresting officer. <laughs> do you do that? What, wank outside or order my coins? Do you order your coins? Uh, yeah, I do. I think everyone It's just that. fun, though, isn't it? <laughs> it's just fun. <laughs> well, 6 times 100 is 600. Uh -huh. Plus 50, plus 10, plus 6. Yeah. Well done. 666. Six, six. <laughs> I don't really clapping. Yeah, it's spooky, isn't it? John, how did you do? Uh, 50 divided by 10. It's five. Plus six. Plus six is eleven. Plus a hundred. Oh. Plus one hundred for one, one, one. Times by six. Times wow. the other six, 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 six. <laughs> showing off, though, wasn't it? Showing off. I mean, you both got it right, but that is showing off. We're both putting the bins out. <laughs> <laughs> it's just like he's doing it backwards, like this moonwalk. <laughs> his bins out. Yeah. Okay. I'm just wheeling them out going, there's the bins, they're out. <laughs> Same job's been done. I genuinely do wheel them backwards. <laughs> so that if anything falls out while I'm wheeling it, I don't stand in it. But that's just... Everyone does that, right? Oh, God! <laughs> We're sapping our will to live. So I've brought these selection of chilies with me, and any time I do not score points in a round, I will eat a chilli. <laughs> How are you with spicy food? Hate it. <laughs> I tend to be instantly sick. Unless it goes down, in which case, more of a problem tomorrow. <laughs> OK, John, did you get it? No. <laughs> OK. Oh, uh, Sean, would you like to... <laughs> would you get a bigger chilli? I'll just do it like this. I won't do it, I'll do it like Lucky Dip. Uh, there we go, that one. Oh! <laughs> OK, just in one, I think. I'd wipe can't. it under your arm. So, yeah. <laughs> Kill the power of it, does it? Yeah. No, it's just Sean hasn't washed his hands. <laughs> <laughs> oh, John. Oh, you've got a lovely little bit of chilli left there. <laughs> John, come on, don't... Seriously, don't waste it. <laughs> <laughs> Rachel, could that be done? I've got a lot of ways for one away, but I've no idea if it can be done. Okay, well, come and eat your chilli. <laughs> <laughs> How about 
bad is it, John? <laughs> <laughs> I talk again later. <laughs> Okay, like, the interesting thing about it is that it gets worse. <laughs> <laughs> it starts off all right, and then it just progressively deteriorates. <laughs> yeah, that, that'd be fine. You'll probably be fine. <laughs> if it we would be really good for my... That was nails, isn't it? <laughs> 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 I felt so good. <laughs>